Hey YouTube, it is Easy Prepper 101, and today I'm super excited to tell you I, I just purchased two rain barrels, and these both hold 50 gallon each, which would be a total of 100 gallons. And um, been been talking, been watching a lot of YouTube, and been talking to a lot of people about doing a garden. Um, we up we got a new privacy fence, which kind of we got more property, which was actually able to help me do this. So one of the biggest things is I've been kind of starting to piece it together is um, with the rain barrels, wood, and uh, even solar. So I'll get into that at the very end of the video, but I ended up picking these two rain barrels and Costco just started to uh, have these out. And when me and my wife went on a Friday night, about a half hour before they closed, they had about 10 of these. And me and my wife went on Sunday, right around 11 o'clock, and they only had four left. So they sold, these are selling quick. So that's the one thing about Costco, if you see something, get it if you can afford it to but if not if you're able to you know to get one get one but um i picked up two so just to kind of give you a close-up here of the side you know 50 gallons super stoked but as we turn around to the front here as you can see in the picture there's kind of like two spots where you can have a faucet you know to release the water so there's the one at the bottom and then when we rotate barrel there's the other one so um you know they're very nice kind of very decorative and stuff um you go to the back you know very you know very kind of flush so you can put it against your rain gutter and and everything else um this is actually these two spots is where you're actually going to drill to into your uh gutter to where the water will dump um you can have for like a check valve um, which we'll get into that here in a second but when we get to the top here, I've, as you see, I've already unscrewed this one so I can pull all the hardware out so you guys can see it. But uh, there's two of these kind of little plastic nets here and look inside. So um, the one thing um, I have, I've watched, there's a YouTuber out there that who actually did a review on these. And he actually did say that this screen here doesn't let the water go through right away and he ended up was having a runoff here so he was actually losing water and so he actually came up with a another way to get like a like a different type of a mesh and kind of still use these holes to uh, uh so you can collect the water so you're not losing water but um but super pumped about these two so what i'm gonna do now i'm gonna pause the video and i'm gonna show you everything that you actually get i mean you actually get a lot of hardware for this kit for being 90 bucks because i was looking at purchasing you know 55 gallon like one of the blue drums <coughs> the hardware and everything else and um after you know you start piecing something together you're you know it's kind of a little bit more money you know you're you're putting into it so um i decided to kind of go with this route to see if this is going to work or not but let's i'm going to stop talking and i'm going to uh, get all the hardware spread out so you kind of see uh, what you actually get and um, uh, the price for one of these is $90 so like $89.95 so for both of them you know they're $90 a piece so not a bad price but for you know to 100 gallons of water is definitely uh, you know to do in a garden you definitely need to have so but we're going to pause the video show you what we get in the hardware all right uh, as you can see this is all the hardware that you get inside one of the drums uh the other hardware is still in uh the other drum but i just was just trying to so you guys could see this so um if you guys want to pause it it kind of tells you everything that you gotta get in there and that and this has a uh, step by step of how to uh install everything but as you can see the the bits in here um are used to uh connect the back of the drum as you can see where you're going to put your hose at that attaches it so I mean I'm kind of skipping it but you guys are kind of seeing the idea of, of how how this actually goes in so I mean the instructions are really good I know I'm kind of going quick because I'm going to do a more detailed one for installing this kind of a step by step for you guys to kind of see this and uh, connecting them in that so um, but yeah so we're definitely going to be um, installing it but um, this is actually the piece that you're actually going to put in your gutter and then when the water comes down around the side there's actually little holes as you can see where the water will go into the rain barrel so um, screws there's the that goes into your uh, 
down uh, the gutter and then you have your hardware the these nice faucets and then they nice to give you the tape so you know gives you you know the hardware that you're gonna need for this and what to do you know if you want to you know add on to so um, where you can then transfer from one um, one one barrel to another so we're like I said I'm super excited about you know what we have here uh, we're gonna I'm gonna kind of pack this up and uh, we're gonna wrap this up for you all right guys we're gonna be we're kind of wrapping this video up but I'm super excited to have these rain barrels here um, if you guys have any tips or anything that you guys could maybe help with installing you know these types of rain barrels are just rain barrels that maybe makes it easier when you're can you know when you're connecting this rain barrel to another one so they both fill up um, write those in the comments section down below because doing a rain catching system never done before so I'm gonna be you know continuing to read do research and you know any help that you guys can kind of give of when connecting you know the two rain barrels up so they both fill up or you know that will help you know maybe something that you learned um greatly appreciate that write that down below um if you have used this type of the rain barrel you know that the the good idea you know what is what this brand is called you know let me know um like i said i did see the one youtuber saying about replacing this so you can gather more because it just comes right off so but getting these rain barrels is something been a long time coming to do this garden you know we're going to be doing a solar kit and installing the solar kit getting it all prepped up because <clears throat> how um, where my gutter is we're going to be doing this in the back is um is going to be on one side of the house and then which is not ideal but that's where the downspout is and but where these are going to go it doesn't get a lot of sun so we have to so i'm going to be running a um a hose across the grass to where the my uh raised beds are going to be so one how one thing i had to think about was how am i going to transfer out so how am i going to transfer the water from these out so uh, i was looking at harbor freight and they have kind of like a, a transfer pump that will you know take the water out of this and just kind of shoot it out for uh for the raised beds i'm going to be doing a drip system uh for the raised uh for the flower beds but I'm really, you know, that's going to be coming down the line talking about that. But the solar kit, you know, that I have with, is this, it's a, everything I got was from, is the Harbor Freight from the inverter to the battery to the, the, the surge protector. So you don't overload your battery to that. So, I mean, you know, when it comes to solar, I'm going to be a rookie. I'm going to be learning. So when we get to that video, anything, any I, um, helpful tips that you guys can maybe help with installing or using that. Let me know when it comes to the solar kit. Same thing with the garden. Once we get farther on down the right line, we're going to be building the raised beds. So we got some fantastic videos coming down the line from the water system here, you know, the rain catching, installing these and, you know, seeing how they do, you know, did I do it right? Did I not do it right? But we're going to learn from, you know, using this rain catching system. Also, you know, from building the rain raised beds. And also like I once again, the Harbor Freight uh, Solar Kit, and then taking you on the, on the journey of growing, you know, well, wherever we're able to grow. You know, um, I've talked to a lot of people who have grown stuff, and, you know, they've told me to be patient that, you know, you're going to have some failures your first time or you're in first year. So, um, you know, I'm going to be, I'm, I'm trying to be positive that hopefully I can grow some stuff. That would be great. Um, one more thing, too. Sorry for the shaky camera because I'm still kind of holding uh, the small little tripod. Um, just because I just want you guys to see the, you know, the rain barrels and I'm super excited about this. So once again, thank you guys so much. Write down in the comment section below um, what you guys think. And uh, like I said, any helpful hints, hit that thumbs up if you like this video. And if you haven't, please hit the subscribe button. Thank you guys so much. And we will catch you guys down the road.